Spirit Temple, here we go. This is on our deposits? What was that big chunk of something? What is that? Oh damn it, showed up. Big hunk of rock. Those are zonite yeah. deposits. Ah, uh, zonite yeah. deposits. Anyway, got 
why he, she's here. We're gonna climb up these steps. Strap a, a rocket to its back. Oh, we're getting near the end. I think after this is the Ganon, is the, like the, the bar is the uh, Ganondorf. We're looking for, we're, we're getting the last sage. That construct, 
I made it long ago. But the glow. It must be under the control of something monstrous. Yeah, it's called gloom. If the Demon King has turned my creation into his pawn, we must defeat it. We can do this together, Link. Do we have to? Let's go. We have to stop that construct. Those devices are very dangerous. Be careful. is gonna get four on and then of course. We brought out more arms. Be careful. We won't last long at this rate. We need to find another approach.
monsters. We must think of something else. is down, the boom is gone, and we got another heart. This is one of the sages. This is like the last sage before the final boss. You gotta find her and basically put her back together. You're gonna find a temple, but this is a storyline. Like this part of the, like this is part of the story. You gotta piece her back together. Secret stone. Yeah. Yeah, right, but I'm gonna beat this game first. I wanna finish this and get this over with. I think uh, the final boss is after this. 
Then Ganondorf Zelda is after asked this. me to aid you, Link. I am the Sage of Spirit, and one of the Zonai. Mineral. <laughs> mineral? Like mineral? Like vitamins and mineral? I am glad to meet you, Link. I must thank you. It is because of you that we have recovered my secret stone. Originally, my intent was to awaken when you first found the Poripad. Then to guide you to my construct and assist you on your journey. I had not anticipated a battle with that same construct. You have proven quite adept, and I am grateful for all your efforts. Link. Here. In the name of Minoru, Sage of Spirit, I grant my power unto you. I believe it will serve you well. With this power I've given, a deep bond has been forged between us. And from this point forward, my spirit will reside within that construct. I will help you however I can. Past in the age of Hyrule's founding, circumstances forced me to forsake my body and become a pure spirit. Long have I slumbered within Zelda's pura pad in order to share what I knew when it passed down into your hands. I apologize, our meeting has been so long delayed. The Demon King's interference is to blame. Nevertheless, I ask your pardon. Well, then. Now, on to the topic at hand. In my own age, it disappears from your perspective. Zelda awakened us. I was Zelda and awakened as the Sage of Time and appeared before us. What I may, what I must relate to you is a tragedy that occurred in Hyrule's history. At its crux was Zelda, who held a secret stone in traverse time. Uh -huh. She made a momentous decision in those days gone by. I would have you know of the resolve um, poured into that blade, the Master Sword. Long ago, my people, known as the Zonai, came down from the heavens to the surface of the world. It was said they were descendants of gods. They bore treasures from these same gods, secret stones capable of amplifying the abilities of those who possessed them. Using the knowledge of the Zonai, my younger brother Raru became a great leader. He met a young woman named Sonya, and they would wed. Raru gifted Sonya one of the secret stones. Together, they sought to establish their kingdom. This is how the kingdom of Hyrule, with Raru and Sonya as its first king and queen, came to be. The future looked bright. However, tragedy suddenly struck. A man of great evil emerged from the desert. The leader of the Gerudo, Ganondorf, killed Queen Sonya and stole her secret stone. Using the secret stone, Ganondorf transformed into the Demon King. He then created swarms of monsters and attacked. Hyrule rose up to face these threats. But the evil power driving the monsters forward was staggering. The defenders were on the brink of defeat. Raru then came up with a plan to turn the tide of the war. 
He entrusted secret stones to warriors with exceptional abilities. They became sages and united in an effort to finally defeat the Demon King. Raru and the sages outnumbered the Demon King and should have been able to stop him. However... The Demon King's power had grown far beyond anything we could have imagined. I was unable to withstand his strength. Our fight appeared all but lost. And then, Robert... himself to one final act. So smug. I know exactly what it will cost me. <laughs> Thousands of years will pass in the blink of an eye. You won't delay the inevitable. You're wrong. Years from now, someone will appear with the sword that seals the darkness. A swordsman with the power to defeat you, Link. Remember this name. And then Princess Zelda and Link went underneath the castle. Link got his arm burned off and Raru gave his own arm to replace it. So it took all we were able to give to succeed in imprisoning Demon Queen, but I was wounded in the process. My body was soon to expire. As when Zelda came to me bearing a decayed and broken sword. Yes, if you recall, the Master Sword vanished from your hand at the temple. From there, it traveled to the distant past, appearing in Zelda's hands. And now you hold it once again. Yes, I do. You're saying that sword traveled through time the same way you did? Yes, but more importantly, in my original time, the Demon King was vulnerable to even the smallest piece of the sword. Even someone like him has vulnerabilities. Hmm. Then, what exactly are you suggesting we do with the sword? Over time, the Master Sword is able to absorb sacred power. It can heal itself, and even grow stronger. Curious. If we were able to empower it in that way, it could be the key to defeating the Demon King. 
But it could take centuries for that sword to grow strong enough. The power the Demon King wields. I do not see how this can be done. It would be impossible for you to provide it with sacred power for so long. I can think of one way. You mean... Yes, I can do it. I have to. I've told you, that act is forbidden for a very good reason. It would mean throwing yourself away. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, little feline, you are in no condition to give demands. You about to die. <laughs> you won't be able to change back. The moment I had the sword, I knew what to do. <laughs> right. I knew this was why I You won't be able to change sword. back. Well, shit. Ain't like you gonna stop me. You finna go. I... <laughs> to restore the master sword and deliver it to Link. And you only got one eye. You can't even... I know what I'm not being on anymore. I understand. You really have made up your mind? Mm. Very well then. I did. As a Zonai, I bear my share of blame for these events. So I too will devote myself to this goal and to this hero of yours. For the Swordsman Link, I will do everything I can. Even if my body should perish, I will still be with you in spirit. This is a little storyline done. I'm going to go punch Ganondorf in the face. Afterwards, Zelda and I discuss strategy. We laid the groundwork for guiding you in a distant future. Well, Before the gloom's affliction took my life, I became a spirit and entered the poorer pad. Then Zelda did what she felt she must and began be of the forbidden process. She believed you would use the Master Sword to defeat the Demon King and restore peace to Hyrule. Uh -huh. You already have it in your hand. The hope that Zelda left you, the sword that seals the darkness away, the Master Sword. Well then. Oh, no, I mean, with the sword of hope that Zelda left to you, you will surely smite Demon King Ganondorf. I sure do hope so. I'm gonna punch him in the face. <laughs> I'm gonna punch him in the face. Some of this, I can dismiss her. I am a smithing construct mineral created me to try to unlock the hidden position of Zonite charges. I was made with the unique ability to temper Zonite for weapons and equipment. I was driven into hiding when I'm minion of the Demon King occupied the spirit temple. With you and Minoru have cleared the way, I can perform once again. A whole heart of things. Okay. I'm glad to exchange my special, my special weapons with it and equipment with you. It'll be up to you to provide the zonite. Oh, bet. I can get a zonite spear, a zonite. Oh, that's dope. I think I can drop some of these damn. Busted ass shields. Definitely get rid of this. This ain't even good no more. Oh no, that's good. You know what? I don't know. That got 70 on it. I might want to keep that. I'm definitely gonna get. I'm definitely replacing that one. Uh-huh. I, I, I 
know what the hell we doing. Fast travel point. Can I fast travel here? I cannot. I'll just take that with me. I don't know. I invested in weapon spaces earlier. Sword and bows. I, I felt once I got the best, once I got the better shields, I'm not gonna need that much space anyway. So I didn't invest the seeds into the uh, into the shield spaces. Hey, hey, you know what? I did a video like I cheesed the entire fire temple. Yeah. Of course I did. You thought I was going to grind that out? Shoot. I'm not stupid. <laughs> I ain't got time to waste. I ain't got time to waste. You think I'm going to grind out all the rupees? <laughs> no, hell no. Don't give me the rupees. I'm going to glitch the hell out of that. Hey, hey, that was the first thing that I did. What? <laughs> Once I found out they was only giving you like 50 to like 20 rupees at a time, I was like, hell with all that. Uh -huh. right, so we got on the stages. Can't believe this is actually one of the stages of Fist Off Against the Demon King. And now we have news about the princess. That's some relief in that, at least. So in the ancient past, when Zelda worked to restore the decayed monster sword, and returned it to your land, trusting you would defeat Demon King in the present day. She did so much all on her own. What? The master sword was restored, you say? When were you planning to tell me? I mean, I had it the whole time. I thought you would have seen it. But, you know, whatever. And it was found. <laughs> These armor pieces ain't cheap. Exactly. The armor pieces aren't cheap. Exactly. Even more reason why well, I did what I did. And it was found on the head of a white dragon of all places. That's hard to believe. Hmm. This was Princess Zelda's wish, one she believed you strongly in. She, she believed it so strongly that she gave her own her life to see it through for us. I think you're finding that sword. I must say, you really don't look quite your you really don't look quite yourself unless you have the master sword at your side. Check it. Now then, it seems you have all you need to prepare to face the enemy. Yep. This is a Hyrule castle. 